What if your screen could reshape itself like a living canvas? It isn't just a transition, it's a technique to control focus, enhance storytelling, and add more cinematic depth to your motion graphic. In this video, I'll show you how to do this technique in After Effects and enhance the level of your video editing. Start by bringing your video into After Effects. Draw a rectangle that matches the exact size of your video. Set your video's track mat to the shape layer using Alpha Mat to control visibility. Now apply the slider control effect to the shape layer. Duplicate it again. Rename them to size, position, and roundness. Now it's time to parent properties to the exact controller. Size to size controller. As you can see, the size changed. Position to position control and roundness to roundness control. Now you have a control over them here, really easy. You don't need to open lots of properties to find exact one. All of them are in your hands here. Now you can add keyframe to animate it. Start from full screen, and then we want to reshape it to a circle. It is your keyframe. If you have Flow plugin, you should use it. It's way more better than After Effects itself. Now we want to add a stroke to our shape, duplicate our shape, adjust the fill on None, add a stroke. You can have a gradient stroke. Choose your color, and with this handle, you can adjust its color as well. Now we need to a solid color as a background. Okay, now we want to animate our stroke. Add trim path. Add keyframe for a start. Before that, we want to, you know, set our stroke to round cap from here. Now, as you can see, it's been rounded. Okay, let's animate it. Adjust the start on 100, add keyframe, and then set it to zero. Now, as you can see, we have a really beautiful animated stroke. If you want to animate our mask, as you can see, you just need to parent the position of the stroke to the position of the mask. Now, if you move your shape, the stroke will move with it. Or if you want to animate your shape entirely with composition, 
You just need to add keyframes for your composition that it moves with the shape as well. Now you can add more detail to your scene, like text or other graphics. That's it. I hope you enjoy. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you like it, but don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave your comments.